Hey y'all, my name is Jalen and this is Art in Color, a channel where I talk about contemporary artists of color. Today we are going to be talking about Ruby C. Tut, an artist whose deeply colorful works integrate themes of womanhood, spirituality, and self-expression. Before we get into it, please subscribe to my channel so you can get notified every single time I post a video. Now on to the art. When I saw the artist Ruby C. Tut's work at Jessica Silverman Gallery here in San Francisco, I knew I had to talk about it. So here we go. Rupi C. Tut is Sikh Punjabi painter and director who dissects historical and contemporary displacement narratives around diasporic identity, belonging, and gender. She's a first-generation Sikh immigrant who moved to California when she was 11. She's currently based in Oakland, California. Tut's work is guided by centuries-old knowledge engaging in the strict practice of traditional materials and methodology associated with Indian miniature painting and calligraphy. Utilizing these forms, Tut is able to incorporate contemporary images, concepts, and figures to a traditional visual language. Drawing on these ancient artistic forms, the artist's colorful, meticulously detailed compositions explore her lived experiences as well as notions of femininity, strength in womanhood, and ideas of diaspora and diasporic identity. She is often noted that her work is inspired by Indian miniatures. Indian miniatures can be defined as small-scale, highly detailed paintings, often incorporating virtuosic line work. They trace back to at least 9th century CE and often feature intense colors and detailed embellishments. They were typically accompaniments to traditional religious stories. In discussing her interest in incorporating religious imagery into her works, Ruby C. Tut is quoted as saying, For me, religion and artistic voice have been very much intertwined because both are very personal. Religion, and the way you practice and approach it, is very personal. Art is very much a personal practice. Even if you are selling your work and managing the business side of things, when you enter your studio, you are in an honest space at your most vulnerable, open, raw point in being. I think it's very similar to religion. A specific work of hers I would love to discuss is her 2022 painting, Leaving Home. In Leaving Home, Tut utilizes shell gold on homemade hemp paper to depict a collage of hands reaching upwards out of swirling blue patterns of water. Broken into grids, the hands create a linear narrative as the viewer's eyes travel from the top to the bottom of the composition and then back up again. The hands stretch both up and towards one another, recalling notions of kinship, care, and embrace. Ruby C. Tut has had a solo exhibition at the Trite Museum of Art in Santa Clara. She has also had her work shown through talks, exhibitions, and demonstrations in spaces such as the De Young, which is in San Francisco, uh, Stanford University, as well as the Asian Art Museum in San Francisco. As I mentioned at the top of this video, her work is also currently on display at Jessica Silverman Gallery in San Francisco until May 28th of 2022. As always, I'll provide some links below so you can learn more about her work on your own beyond this video. And the question of the day is, can you think of any other artists who are inspired by spirituality or religion within their works? Please leave your answers below and we can talk about it and I'll comment and other people comment, it'll be really cool. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and if you learned something new, share it with a friend. Thank you so much. Until next time, goodbye.